Oh, I'm back everyone. I am walking on a river. The sun's just coming up behind us and I'm out with Mark Whitford right there. We're having a quick session, probably an hour and a half on the water. Before we head off to Codfrance, uh, that's on today in Shepparton. So we're gonna try our luck, film it, hopefully we get a video for you. And then we'll be off at Codfrance, meeting up with a few guys over there, Hawksy, Jerry, uh, the likes, Shaney D from Gouda Gang. And um, yeah, should be a good day. So I hope we get a fish and hope you enjoy. Made it into Codfrance. We're missing Shaney D from Gouda Gang. <laughs> Might be a bit hungover. <laughs> he had a big night last night. I don't think he's going to make it. We have done them in the past and we will do them at Arcadia. Uh, next question. Second question. Why is leaving? If it's really red, why is it closed in that? Four o'clock. Four o'clock. Get October. So, closed season? Yes. So, we do have a, a, a closed season for Murray Cod at that time, but you're right, you can fish for other species. Is that the question? Yeah, that it's why not it why is it not totally closed right. uh, because we want people still to be able to fish for other species so for yellow valley and other species that might be in there we are definitely in the business of making sure that there are opportunities to fish and also protecting those breeding fish so it's a balance there is a closed season for cod but it's not a total fishing closure first question then <laughs> why have we got a closed season for spotted vermin we shut the rivers down, we don't have to fish. Um, do have a closed season for Murray Cod, absolutely. But what about and the spotted vermin, mate? For trout, yeah, we have a closed season we for trout. Yes, we do, yeah. Um, so we support fishing in general and certainly native and trout fishing as well. Thanks, Taylor. Fourth question. <laughs> yeah, right, so old mate got a bit aggressive with his questions. Um, and conference is over for us. We, we skipped before story time. So it's uh, Hawksy, Mark and myself hitting the river for a quick fish. I've got on a ballista smoke. Hawksy's throwing the conference lure, the predator that we got at conference. And Mark's got his uh, Pompey on, Trelly's color. So let's we'll see how we go. You should watch it, Mark. <laughs> On? Yeah. You bastard! <laughs> you came back with his <laughs> That's the fish I just sw had swell me, I reckon. You're the boat in here. <laughs> I was fishing here and he cast down here. I'm like, oh, I'll cast through there. Nah, I'm glad one of us got him. I don't think I just filmed that, guys, but I just caught this mammoth cod on the ballista smoke 65 i think it is beautiful little fish like healthy ass look at that what a gorgeous fish and he's trying to kick. yeah all right we'll uh get him back in the water and keep going keep Hope, looking, hopefully right. another fish Yelling at it isn't going to get you, loser. <laughs> Is it like overhead height? <laughs> <laughs> the things you do for a pump. It's so hot. <laughs> <laughs> it's also like deep. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> How the f was he there the whole time? Oh my god, I thought I was gonna die. <laughs> That's the funniest shit. <laughs> the 
can't touch the bottom. <laughs> Far out, that's deeper than you think. So oh. Corn cob surface lure. That's what I'm going for now. Changed up. Hawksy's had his swim. So, enjoyed it. Some natural hot springs. <laughs> Real freaking naughty. Oh, placement plus. Not placement plus. <laughs> placement minus. <laughs> Yep. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 yep, midget. <laughs> well, marks aren't. <laughs> oh, <really? laughs> so got this uh, little fella on the corn holio. What a what a friggin' cute little piece of fish. That's actually a gorgeous little god. Nice pattern. And uh, perfect swim bait size. That's <laughs> letting go. Who was it? Decent. Got it. That's awesome, man. Yep, yep. That's better. It's not big, but it's better. Better, better. <laughs> I just landed one and these guys are trying to push each other in the river. So there we are guys, that's my third. Second on the Cornholio Codwalker. Pretty happy with that. He came back about 10th cast in the same section of water. Just pays to keep casting. I reckon that's fish of the day. Beautiful so looking tight. little fish. But they've just all been small, but healthy. Like, look at the patterns on that fella. So we're walking back and Hawksy decided he wanted to refish the spot where he went swimming before. Just over there it was, off those trees pretty much. And then he got snared out there and he has to go swimming again. <laughs> oh, that's classic, man. Hawksy loves a good swim. Oh, he got it. And he had to go all the way in. <laughs> anyway, guys, that's it. Don't forget to go and see Mark and Hawksy's. <laughs> <laughs> That's payback, I was expecting that. <laughs> Don't forget to go and see Mark and Hawks' channels. Uh, we all landed fish. Uh, six landed, another dropped, a uh, couple that we missed that were reconverted. Um, for this time of year, really, really good session. So we're very happy with that. So don't forget to go see them. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Really hope you enjoyed, and we'll catch you in the next one.